Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Topps Museum Collection Baseball. Six box, half case, pick your team number 11 from a fresh case right here. So big thanks to all of these lovely people for getting into the action here on a Tuesday, Tuesday the 4th, August already, isn't that crazy? Thank you, thanks everybody. And we did a number block randomizer for these teams right here which I forgot to upload, so I'm gonna do that right now. But there it is, those are the results right there. And you can see the actual randomizing portion in the video that I'm about to upload as we speak. Let's keep the video rolling on this one. I know, very compelling. No, that's, I can't, nope. That's the current video I'm doing. Let me upload the other video. Let's upload that. Arthur, what's going on? Just in time for pick your team number 11. Okay, so I'll put RNB in front of the title so you know that's the number blog. I don't need to monetize that particular video. Next, next, public, publish. I adjust the, uh, the exposure and the white balance on the top camera there. Sure, why not since we're adjusting everything here. All right, let's roll. Here's the fresh case right here. Let's pop this baby open. Ooh, Arthur's looking for an Adrian Beltre. That's a good chase. I did, so we were watching that game right here. Arthur, he had, he had Kawhi and Paul George Draped all over him. Devin Booker with that turnaround jumper. Mid-range jumper. Woo! Dust off your Devin Booker cards, folks. All right, so there's six box on the left side, six box on the right side. We'll get that, get a nice Dodger blue die going here. One, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. Five. So we'll do the right side right here. This we will save for break number 12, which is already on the site in single digits. So if you want to get that going, let's get it going. And I don't, as of now, I don't think there's a number block or anything like that yet. So get into it before there, we can fill this straight up. All right. Lots of great stuff in here. Good luck, ladies and gents. Wait, was it a three? That was it that Devin Booker shot a three? It didn't seem that far away. Maybe it was even better then. Dust off your Devin Booker cards. Are they gonna? Or it was a two? Oh, okay, yeah. I was like, didn't seem that far away. bell ready just in case. Oh, you were saying three for the dice roll, I see. All right, I feel like I haven't done museum collection in a minute or two. But good luck, everybody. All card ship. So everything you see here will go. There is generally a one per one per case frame situation. So if we don't see one in this half, it should be in the next half. Snag all these first. We got uh, Cincinnati with an early one nothing lead on the Cleveland Indians on in the background on MLB Network. We got Let's Play 2, 1 out of 99, Ernie Banks. I'm sorry, throwing Noah Syndergaard around there. All right, and behind Chris Sale 
is dual relic and autograph JD Martinez. Six out of 50 for the Red Sox. Jonathan Kent with the Boston Red Sox. Behind Javier Baez is another autograph. We have Jake Rogers, 200 out of 299 archival autos. Behind Sandy Koufax is Quad Relic Pirates, James and Tyon. Jarrett K with the Pirates. And behind the Gavin Lux sketch reproduction is going to be a dual relic. Max Kepler and Miguel Sano. Some excellent column there. Nice low number. 9 out of 10. Jarrett K with the Twins. The Twins won today. I think they beat the Pirates. All right, next. Yes, Ryan is correct. The non-numbered cards that go to the random number block teams will be randomized as one lot to one person at the end of the break. Let's see, I think... What else do we have? We, we got Red Sox Rays going on right now. That just started, bottom of the first. Any other finals? No, I think Twins just beating the Pirates 7-3 is our only final. We got a ton of other games going on today, though. Looks like still things are still kind of chugging along for baseball after a lot of positive COVID tests for various teams. I guess there's just going to be a lot more double headers towards the end of the season. There's a lot more players from the taxi squad coming up. I guess that's just how they're going to roll. Hopefully this is a, ho hopefully, you know, see, you see everyone see Andrew McCutcheon's comments. Like the Phillies got, got caught up in that whole Marlins mess. I think the Phillies for the most part we're okay, health-wise, but out of an abundance of, of caution, like their some of their games were suspended, and that that was just unfair for Andrew McCutcheon. He thought, which I, which I agree with. So hopefully, it'll be it'll be a lot of players kind of policing themselves and their and their friends and other teams being like, hey, you know, put it all together. Forty-five out of fifty, Clayton Kershaw. Like, get your act together, folks. Don't screw it up for the rest of us. Another Ernie Banks, let's play two to 150. All right, we got Frank Thomas, and he reveals a Jorge Polanco, 270 out of 299, two color dual relic. Another twin for Jarrett. There's Andrew McCutcheon. We were just talking about him. Behind Kutch is Logan Allen, 84 out of 299. Indians. That'll be for Ed Ram. Eighty-four out of two ninety-nine. His teammate Francisco Lindor reveals a quad relic. Colton Wong, six out of seventy-five. Primary pieces. Sam Rail with the Redbirds. We stream seven nights a week. Ryan, Ryan A, both on Instagram and on the main channel here. And Bo Bichette, nice, 267 out of 299. Two sixty seven out of two ninety nine. Blue Jays. Our number block team. So that goes to Blue Jays 7. That'll be for Rick T. There you go, Rick. I don't know. 
know, maybe I'll come in. You never know, Ryan A. So, so tune in. You got to tune in every day. You never know when I'm going to show up. Tune in every day. Don't miss out on me. Even on Sundays and Mondays. Some of you yesterday were lucky enough to see the pug make an appearance on the camera. The pug was back. All right, next box. pronounced Mally? I've been saying Tyler Maley the entire time. It's Mally. At least that's what this broadcaster has said. I'm assuming they have a pronunciation guide from the from the team in their media guide. That's Ted Williams, 67 out of 150. Justin Verlander reveals a Trent Grisham autograph, 46 out of 50. Hit a homer against my Dodgers yesterday. I was tattooed. That'll be for Patrick Colon with the Friars. Behind Lou Gehrig is quad triple relic and autograph. Eleven out of twenty-five. Rafael. I went that. I went the other way, thinking the autographs would be on the right side again. It's just all kind of random. Rafael Devers. Jonathan Kent with the Red Sox, two color, triple relic and autograph. Nice one, John. Behind the kid, Ken Griffey Jr. is Trey Mancini, 31 out of 50. I think the Marlins and Orioles are gonna square off again, to square off tonight. And behind Don Mattingling is gonna be a Yankee, Masahiro Tanaka. Two color quad relic. All right, three boxes to go. Halfway through this, uh, halfway through this half case rig. Oh yeah, Tanaka's a number block team, aren't you? Uh, zero. 10 out of 99. Patrick with that one. Oh, yeah. That Field of Dreams event canceled, too. Which I thought was a great idea. But I think they're going to try to make it up in uh, 2021. I think that's the frame right there. Metal frame. If you're a baseball fan, folks, and if you've not been to the Field of Dreams, it's uh, it's worth a shot, boys and girls. Although there really isn't much to do around there. So you'd have to probably wrap it around another trip. I don't I have no idea, Joe. You tell me if you're in this one. Your name's not on here, but double check your receipts. Your order confirmation, let me know if you're supposed to be in this one. Pick your team eleven. There's Willie Mays to 99. Gotcha. Well, double check your receipts. You don't have to. You don't have to wonder. 
Joe and everybody, and this goes for everybody too. We always send you email confirmations of all of your orders that has the break number on it. And I think online too, if you if you go to your account page, it should, should give you an, an order history as well if you're registered for our website. Um, Acuna Jr. reprint, Sketch Repro. There's Jose Ramirez, 75 out of 199. Triple Relic and Autograph. Uh, Indians, that'll be for Ed Ram with the Tribe. Behind Rivera is going to be a Quad Relic All Blue Jays, a quartet of Bluebirds. Vlad Guerrero Jr., Bo Bichette, Kevin Biggio, and Lourdes Gurriel Jr., 5 out of 25. Blue Jays without a nest this season. Poor guys. Behind Jesus Lazardo, who I think is making a start tonight, is a relic Miguel Andujar, 24 out of 50. A bit of the pinstripe in there for the Yankees. And that's number f Yankees 4 is going to be for Dave Larson, last spot mojo. And the frame behind Brendan McKay is going to be out of five. Four out of five, Tim Lincecum. Timmy. Silver ink autograph for the hated ones, my rivals, the Giants. Jeffrey S. gets a nice hit here, though. Nice. He was pretty good. Pretty darn good. All right. As you know, everybody, out of fives and under, get the train whistle. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. I might need a little. Uh... Oh, we have used this a lot. <laughs> Too many big hits. We'll work on. We'll work on that little plunger there later. No worries, Jeff. Thanks for grabbing the Giants straight up. All right, two boxes to go. <laughs> we'll find some. Yeah, I know where to, I, I know where to look for them. All right, two boxes to go. How do we choose the price of each team per break? Ah, we just put prices in a hat. We just kind of guess. Like I guess this should be this much. No, there, there is uh, a lot of factors involved. That Nick prices the teams, and it's based on the checklist. It's based on the quantity and quality of the hits. Yeah, supply and demand comes into play. All sorts of little factors that come into to pricing uh, teams for a picker team. So that's why everyone's prices can be a little different, you know. There's a patented formula, Nick Jaspi is saying. I, I feel like in my head it looks it looks like the big uh, the big computer an imitation game with Kira Knightley and Benedict Cumberbatch. Yeah, and it's like. And all those gears are just tur turning. Man, it's crazy. Crazy. I have six monitors. And six I just, monitors I, up. I, I punch the numbers. I punch the all numbers. sorts of numbers being crunched and punched. There's Carlos Correa to 99. I'm like Billy Bean. When everyone else zigs, I zag. Yeah, he's zagging. Yeah. So it's a lot like... Uh, so, so every breaker will have their opinion on the price of a team. So. And I'm Brad Pitt. I just need my Jonah Hill now. He just needs a Jonah Hill. So maybe Sean. <laughs> 17 out of 25, Trey Mancini. So we're hiring Jonah Hill if he's out there is essentially what I heard from Nick. 
Orioles, Joe Andreessen with your second Trey Mancini relic. That's that's even nicer one. Behind Pete Alonso is a quad relic, Bryce Harper. Primary pieces, nice. That's for the Phils. Derek Hamilton with the fighting Phils. Behind the kid, Sketch Repro is Jack Flaherty, Captain Jack, 88. Out of 299, Cardinal Sam Rail with the Redbirds. I think Jack Flaherty's an LA guy, if I'm not mistaken. And behind Walker Bueller, I think Jack Flaherty and Walker Bueller get a lot of comparisons. Triple Relic and Autograph, Nick Senzel. 183 out of 199. Is he up to bat? No, that's Akiyama up to bat. Nick Senzel is Ed Ram and the Reds. And the final box coming up. Um, I don't think anything else is sold out at the moment, folks. I do see do see about 20 orders coming in, so maybe something sold out while we were doing this break. We'll find out. We'll go through orders. We'll figure it out. Looks like that cello pack sold out. Looks like one left in choice. That's going to happen soon. What else? That's about it. Yeah, that's about it. But I, but I think some other people have been doing work on other breaks to help fill those up. So keep it, go keep it going. Keep it up. Burbank for Flaherty. Yeah, I knew he was close. Sam, do you happen to know what high school? Did he go to Burbank High School? Yeah, I knew he was in the area. I know uh, some of you may be familiar with, uh, with John Boy, right? The, the video guy. I've been watching him for years. He produces some pretty good content. Some of you may know him from the uh, from the Astros stuff too. Anyway, uh, last summer I missed this. I wasn't able to go to this, but last summer they uh, they did a live like podcast at a brewery in Santa Monica, and Jack Flaherty was like one of the guests. A couple other guys, maybe Trevor Pluff, I think, who joined their team, the John Boy team. But. Uh, Oh, he went to Harvard Westlake. Okay, that makes sense. I was like, he probably didn't go to like a standard public school. All right, Nan Nancy singing, singing, say my name, say my name. She needs a hit here. No one is around me. I don't know the words to that song. It's a good tune, though. Maybe on the next playlist. Trey Turner, 99. And some member. Everything ships. So all this stuff will ship. Good looking cards. High end set. All right. So last four hits, Justin Verlander reveals an autograph. It's a Ray, 60 out of 299. Tampa Bay Rays, Robert G, Robert Baricki. Arthur needs some Rangers too. Lou Gehrig, behind Lou Gehrig. There it is. Wow. How did you do that, Arthur? That's sorcery. I feel like we're going to have to throw you into a lake. With stones strapped to your chest. That's exactly. Last, call, last call five teams in the next half. The number blocks. Two color patch and autograph. The player he was chasing. That's why he bought the Rangers. Five out of fifteen. Adrian Beltre. Is that that? No, no. What is it blue? I thought it's like a faded kind of blue. I guess it is game used. So there you go. He's a witch, a sorcerer. Must be burned at the stake for that kind of prediction. Lorenzo Cain, 5 out of 25. Brew Crew, Scott Pelzer. And last but not least, is Michael Conforto, 60 out of 99. Quad relic for the Mets. Uh, Ray A with that one. People call you Ray, Raymond Ayala. It's like a good, it's a good baseball nickname, Ray. A. Right there, there you go, Michael Conforto. There for you. There it is. No randomizers, no nothing. 
That's it. Oh, I do. I, let's do a quick randomizer actually for the non numbered cards in the number block. So let's flip back to this screen right here. Let's grab everybody's names and let's put them into this list right here. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Three and a one, four times. Name on top. After four, one, two, three, and fourth and final time. Name on top is going to be Nancy. Nancy, you'll get any of the non numbered cards for this these group of teams right here. So thanks for breaking with us. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com, and I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.